did the Home Secretary speak to the Met Commissioner in the run-up to the vigil? If so, will she tell the House now what guidance and advice she gave the Met Police in advance of the vigil? I had been in touch with the Metropolitan Police Commissioner on Friday and throughout the weekend and we have had extensive discussions in terms of planning, preparation for the vigil at the weekend. I should, however, Mr Speaker, emphasise that on Friday there was legal action underway. So until that legal action had been determined, um, and of course the Metropolitan Police, um, the Commissioner and the Met Police themselves were engaging with the organisers of the visual, um, there, there were various plans that the police were working on. I will be very clear though, on Friday my views were known and they were based on the fact that um, people who wanted to pay tribute, obviously within the locality, bear in mind we are in a pandemic, we cannot forget that, we are in a health pandemic, that people who live locally, clearly who, who, who were either out, you know, on a daily basis, passing through, laying flowers is absolutely the right thing to do and we saw many people doing that. But of course, as I've said, those scenes on Saturday evening were upsetting. That is the reason why I asked for the Metropolitan Police Commissioner to provide a report on the event itself, what happened, and now why we have a lessons learned review into the operational um, effect and impact in terms of what happened.